Uh, this is going to be a slightly different video here. I just wanted to um, do a, a quick little update on my uh, spring training uh, success uh, rate of the people, different uh, people that I have sent out. And uh, I'll just uh, let you know which ones I have gotten. Um, I have sent off about 16 people. This is the official list that I had written down. I had sent Sean Doolittle, uh, did not get, Mike Clevenger. Sam Dyson was the first one I believe I got. I mean, I'm not really sure if that was a spring training, but uh, we'll get into that later. Uh, John Gray, Charlie Blackman, uh, Kyle Gibson, uh, Sal Romano was, the uh, I think, the, the second one I got. Uh, Nolan Fontana, Joachim Soria. Uh, I had written the teams, which I thought that they were a lot of people were having issues of where they were going to be at. and uh, Mark Rippers... Oh, I can't even pronounce that. Some guy on the um, on the Mariners, Brandon Finnegan, Ken Giles. These are all pitchers mostly. Ivan Nova, Greg Holland. That was an RTS. Nick Pavetta and Kevin Segrist. And um, so uh, those are the the ones that I sent out. And as I said, I got Sam Dyson, and I got. Um, uh, uh, Sal Romano, and those are the only two out of all those. I didn't know if any of these guys signed. I just sent them. These mostly were duplicates. I think the Clevenger was not a duplicate, and the Pavettas were two that I had sent out and uh, sent him a hockey card. Maybe it'll come back next year. I have no idea. Maybe he's still working on them. Don't really have any clue. Um, uh, there were still a few number of days, and there was still time left, and when many of these, I think, up to Ken Giles, maybe. Um, that's, that was my first lot, and then I sent four more, and anyway, I uh, just wanted to see what you got, um, maybe you guys have an update list or something of what you got in or what you didn't get in, uh, that's really all I have for you today, I bought some printer ink for some, uh, autograph projects and spent ten bucks on Amazon, how does that happen, well, it was on sale and it was the, uh, discount ink, but everybody seemed to give it a good rating and it uh, sure beats buying a new printer at this moment. So we'll see how that goes and we'll figure that out and uh, thank you for watching.